Welcome to Age of Empires 2 Definitive Edition. I'm Matthew Turk, the Community Manager from Forgotten Empires, one of the development partners of Age of Empires 2 Definitive Edition. At E3, we were actually lucky enough to be able to plug in and get some motion capture so we can actually show you the demo here in all of its 4K glory. Our biggest priority with Age of Empires 2 Definitive Edition was to preserve the core aspects of gameplay that made Age of Empires 2 what it was and how it stood the test of time. We've added numerous new features to highlight a lot of these points and some of those features we'll have a look at right now. The first of these being the zoom we're showing on screen right now. You can zoom in and out at your leisure whether you need pinpoint accuracy or to see an entire battle unfold before you. As you've no doubt noticed, we've recreated all the graphics from the ground up in stunning 4K. Our biggest priority with this was to stay as true as possible to Age of Empires 2. At buildings, you're now able to queue researchers and unit production at the same time. On top of that, we've also added a global queue towards the top of the screen. At the mill, you're also able to automatically requeue farms. And before I forget, Yes, you can automatically reset fish traps. One of the biggest questions we've been asked is will Age of Empires 2 Definitive Edition receive mod support? The answer to that is a yes, a big, big yes. We've got some of the basic mods actually coming with the game, so small trees, grid mode, etc. will actually be in there from the beginning. And on top of that, you'll be able to access a whole list more mods, whether you're on the Microsoft Store or on Steam through the Age of Empires website. The pricing is also correct. Age of Empires 2 Definitive Edition at launch will only be $20, and if you own HD, on top of that you'll also get a 25% discount towards the game, making it only $15. So what exactly do you get for your $20? Your $20 will get you Age of Empires 2 Definitive Edition, which includes every single DLC released for HD Edition. On top of that, you'll get four new civilizations and three brand new campaigns. The old campaigns are even receiving a touch-up as we speak. This brings a total civilization count to 35, and an estimated over 200 hours of campaign gameplay alone. That doesn't include multiplayer or AI guys, 200 hours of just campaign. Even for the competitive scene we've got changes, and for those wondering at home, yes, this 20 year old game still has a thriving competitive community. We've been looking into balance with a lot of the professional players from the beginning, and on top of that as well, matchmaking. Yes, matchmaking. Now we do remember that we mentioned the fact you'll be able to download mods for the Microsoft Store and of course for Steam as well. That means yes, we will be supporting crossplay on this, so wherever you decide to play your games, you will not be on your own, you'll be able to play with your friends, whether you prefer Steam, the Microsoft Store, it's all up to you. We'd also like to add that the current beta for Age of Empires 2 Definitive Edition has started. You can sign up and potentially get a key to be involved at the Age of Empires website. Getting back to multiplayer for a second here, there will also be an integrated leaderboard and ladder, and spectator mode that will be added into the game as well. Various hotkey presets will be there from the beginning, so you'll have original and grid, and the ability of course to customise your own. For those that love scenario design, you'll also find new terrains, units, heroes, buildings, and even eye candy to help you build your own world, scenarios, and stories. New triggers as well, you can even create extravagant scenarios utilising these as well. So, who knows, Moby inside of AoE 2? Uh, give it a crack. All the sounds have been updated and the soundtrack itself has been rearranged entirely. Luckily we were able to put that one in the background for you. On top of that as well, the UI is entirely scalable now as well. We also understand that Age of Empires 2 has been around for 20 years and makes it a little bit intimidating when there's been people playing it since release to get involved in multiplayer. Because of that, we've added a whole advanced set of tutorials behind this as well to help you learn the new strategies, the current meta, and even some of the more advanced tactics used in the game today. In summary, this is only a small amount we've shown you as for what's coming in Age of Empires 2 Definitive Edition. The biggest thing I can ask is please get involved in the beta guys, ageofempires.com. If your system specs actually meet what is required to run the game, eventually you will get a beta key. We want as many people on board as we can with this, so please sign up. Let's make this the best Age of Empires 2 that we possibly can. Hopefully we'll see you in the beta.